Hello everyone, it's me Jebby from Unic Tutorials. Today, in this video, I will show you how to change the fonts of any icons in any Windows computer. So, without any further delay, let's begin. So, here you can see the fonts, it's on the name written. So, you can see, I don't know what font is it. So, we don't have an option to directly change uh, fonts, that's when we right click or we don't have any options to change the font of these letters or the alphabets so how you can do it so for this you need to open any web browser and in the google search you need to search this application name as win arrow tweaker just so search this application in the google search and once you search this you will see its official website winarrow.com you can see here win arrow tweaker just click on it Now you can see it's well official websites now just scroll down below now you can see here two download links just click on the first one now just scroll down below now here you can see downloading click here to download the file just click on it to download the application so just click on ok to download it wait for a few seconds until the downloading gets complete so finally the downloading has been completed so let me go to the folder now let me close the web browser now you can see here here is one software so you need to extract this this is a zip file just double left click it to extract it click on ok now you will see one folder name as win arrow tweaker so under this folder you will see two application right so here you can see below win arrow tweaker just double left click it to run the installer now click on next click on next click on i accept click on next click on next click on install so the application has been installed as you can see here on the desktop so you can select the run win arrow tweaker and click on finish now click on i agree now you can see the software user interference right so i'll not talk much about the all the options that are available here so you can try other features or options that are available here but here i'm just gonna talk about the how to change the fonts of any icons in windows computer so for this scroll down below as you can see here under the advanced appearance settings you can see your icons right just click on it now here on the right panel you can see here change font right just click on it now there's lots of font styles so you can choose any style of this font so i'll just select this one font name as hello solid After selecting you can select the font style also and you can change the size of the fonts also you can select the respective size but right now i'll just keep it as it is so i'll click ok now once your all selections for the settings is done you can see your apply changes just click on apply changes now you will be shown one message you want to sign out now or i will do it myself later so you need to sign it out by clicking on sign out that is the log off so finally after signing out and signing in again you can see the fonts of the all the icons has been changed to the selected fonts which you have selected earlier using the wind arrow tweaker so let's go to this pc also you can see the all the folder or drive or any icons even a desktop all the icon fonts has been changed to the selected fonts so in this way you can change the fonts of any icons in any windows computer very easily so if you want to revert it back to the default one what you need to do is just open or run the software again that is the win arrow tweaker again and head over to the same options to the advanced appearance settings and select the icons and now on the right side you can see on the above after selecting the icons you can see here reset this page to default just click on this now you need to sign out again 
so now you can see after signing out and signing in again we have reverted back to the default phones for all the respective icons that are available in our windows computer so in this way you can change the phones of any icons in any windows computer very easily so if you never known about this cool application then definitely you should check it out and if you find any difficulty in using this application feel free to leave your comments below i'll try my best to help and guide you with your problems so if you find this video tutorial useful click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching